going standing there. 20 seconds. I will tell that story then while it's recording. <laughs> Nobody on Zoom? Nope. So be quick. Good to go. Um, good evening. My name is John Hens. I'm the chairman of the Planning and Zoning Committee. I represent District 21, which consists of the south side of the city of Oshkosh, along Lake Winnebago, and around the airport. In a moment, I'll ask the members of the committee to introduce themselves, and I will also ask the staff to introduce themselves and explain the appeals procedure. The hearing process is as follows. Please turn off or silence your cell phones. All testimony is given for the record. Please come forward when recognized and you will be sworn in by the stenographer. When talking, please speak clearly so that all in attendance can hear what you have to say. When you are giving your testimony, please state that you are for or against the item that you are testifying about. The committee doesn't want conversations between members of the audience. If you feel the need to have a conversation with other individuals, we would ask that you leave the room. If you have questions of a particular speaker, please come forward and ask your questions of the committee, and we will try to find the answers for you. The committee will make its decision on Friday, December 2nd. As with all county meetings, it is an open meeting. However, no additional testimony will be given at that time. This is your one and only opportunity to present your testimony for the record. The deliver deliberative meeting is held in the third floor conference room of this building, the City Administration Building on Otter Street, and the meeting time is at 7.30 a.m. And before I turn it to uh, turn it over to introductions. Um, or is excused for this evening. I just want to make sure that's on the record and never introductions. I'm Mary Beth Gabbard. I represent District 12, which is a portion of the city of Oshkosh and a portion of the town of Oshkosh. Good evening. I'm Tom Egan and I represent District 33. Hello, I'm Shana Zestera and I represent District 32. Brian O'Rourke from the Winnebago County Planning and Zoning Department. Daniel Lafave, uh, Winnebago County Code Enforcement Officer. The appeals process is as follows for a zoning map or text amendment. Uh, number one, anyone wishing to protest a zoning map amendment needs to do so at least 24 hours prior to the item being considered by the county board. That's per Wisconsin statute 5969. Uh, contact the zoning office during normal working hours and staff will assist with this procedure. Two. An agreed person may appeal a final decision relative to a code amendment, either text or map amendment, by filing an appeal with a court of competent jurisdiction within 30 days of the final decision. Thank you. And with that, we'll move on to our agenda. Item number one. Application number 2022-ZC-6210. Applicant, Luker Revocable Trust, Leon and Ann. Agent Bill Free, Free Consulting Services LLC, location and premises west of 2712 Nakaimai Avenue, tax parcel number 004 0124, legal description being part of lot two of CSM 5076, located in the south half on the southwest corner of section 13, township 17 north, range 16 east, <coughs> town of Black Wolf, Winnebago County, Wisconsin. Explanation applicant is requesting a zoning map amendment from A2 General Agriculture District to R1 Rural Residential District. Thank you. And I'm just looking to see if we have anybody on. Oh, yep. Do we have. Uh, no, we don't. Do we, okay, we don't have anybody on Zoom. We don't have anybody here. So we move on. Um, do you have any correspondence or communications? We have no correspondence from the town. Um, I can read the uh, staff report here. <clears throat> okay. Um, oh, I do have correspondence from the town. Excuse me. <laughs> Please. Um, so the town board, um, Black Wolf, has approved this. Uh, their findings were town has an adopted land use plan. Action agrees with town land use plan. Um, and it was signed and dated November 14th of 2022. Anybody? We want to edit number two. Okay. Please, Brian. We'll let her start with the okay. Please request it first. Okay. 
application number 2022-ZC-6230, applicant Winnebago County Planning and Zoning, agent Brian O'Rourke, Winnebago County Zoning Department, location of premises, multiple countywide parcels, tax parcel number various, legal description various, explanation, applicant is requesting a zoning map amendment to rezone parcels from 8-1 to 8-2. So if you'll recall, we had the discussion at one of our planning meetings, I believe it was in April regarding this project. This was the last step we needed to do for the farmland preservation plan. The committee at that time asked us to wait until fall to send out the letter, which we did. We sent out a letter to anyone with A1 zoning under county zoning jurisdiction. We also sent them a list of all their parcels and a self-addressed prepaid envelope to send back. This is what we have received so far. However, I did get an email from the Town of Vina Chairman requesting a 30-day adjournment. Apparently, they came under ownership of a parcel that was included in this mailer that they wanted put on one of their means so that they could discuss it. Given the fact that we have no deadline to do this, we don't, staff does not have a problem with that. You hear what you said? Who was that from, that letter? Bob Schmeichel. Oh, okay. County, okay. And Bob is the town chair. Right. So is that something we actually vote for now? Yeah, I need a motion. Yes. So we so motion we, to adjourn in a second. Motion to adjourn for 30 days? Yes. Also moved. Moved and seconded. Any discussion? Seeing none. Are we going to go ahead and are we going to put a pending date on this? We don't have to. We're not under any deadline to get this done. This is just something the county is doing. A lot of the towns have already done this, but um, given the fact we don't have a deadline, 30 day adjournment is fine. That would give them time to do what they had asked to be done. So I have no problem with that, but are we going to put a deadline on this? I just on this one, on this whole thing. No, there's no need to. So they can keep sending this in all the time. No, 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 no. There is a dead. I'm sorry. There is was a deadline for them to return it, which was November 11th. However, we can accept a request up to and including the public hearing. Okay. So. So then we're just going to postpone it to next month. Sir, next, next month. Next month. The next public hearing. Okay. So we'll move and second. Any, any other questions or discussion? All those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? No. Okay. We will see that one in a month. And I'm seeing I'm nothing. Sure. Seeing <laughs> nothing. Second. 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 Second.